So I got a lot of comments like this on my Cheesecake Factory video, click through and watch it if you haven't already, asking how could the design of the Cheesecake Factory possibly be inspired by Victorian architecture? So let me break it down. The first thing to remember is that all of this influence is going to be through the lens of postmodernism which means it's going to have an overall exaggerated look. But the most obvious Victorian inspired element is the use of dark beadboard, which Cheesecake Factory designer Rick McCormick has explicitly cited being drawn from Victorian architecture of San Francisco. Beadboard was really common during the Victorian era. Beyond that, I see two other similarities with Victorian architecture, eclecticism and busyness. Victorians drew from tons of architectural styles sometimes mixed together all in one building. For example, this Victorian building behind me has Flemish, Venetian Gothic, and Romanesque Revival features. On the exterior of the Cheesecake Factory, I see vaguely Greco-Roman and Moorish Revival features. On the interior, we can see obvious Egyptian and Tuscan influences. While we're inside, let's talk about busyness. As the Spruce said, Victorians had an unapologetic devotion to ornament and maximalist interior design, which is also obviously the case with the Cheesecake Factory. You can't get more maximalist than their menu. 253 different items, the most delicious of which might be the pink lemonade. Anyways, let me know your thoughts in the comments.